beckoning Na'Vi in. And they will come. 30 seconds. A shot from Ben. Eviscerates safe on the top. And now Yuri needs a multi-kill. They throw themselves at him round the corner. And Yuri decimates their opposition. Four kills. Three health. Simple shutdown. And it's a fury around. They don't care. Even, even though the Eagles out, they're like, yeah, whatever. We're still going to fight. Yeah, he's more than more than happy. <laughs> more than happy, and yeah, the coach doesn't even care either. He's calling for more chance as the game goes on. And Rio is obliging him. 15 to 6. Nine chances for Furia. Yeah, he's given up coaching and is now you know just a conductor instead. Be sure to check out CSGO.net. Use code SKB for 40% deposit bonus. I unboxed Beach Case and get AWP Containment Breach. It was over $17 profit. I decided upgrade this AWP for AWP Neo Noir. Luckily for me, the upgrade was successful, making another $9 profit. Go to CSGO.net and get Dream Skins from many different cases. CSGO.net. Click link in the description and win but look at Yuri's position. They're doing the round the world strategy. This is not something we normally see at this level. I wonder if they're going to be ready. Safe is there and he spotted it out. That's some good info, but Tabson is there on the return. Yuri would have to come up with some heroics here. He's going to pick up one kill, but a lot more to be done. He's sandwiched in there all around him and he's still fighting. He'll take down Searson as well, spins around and Yuri, oh my God, he's saving the team. Kido is on his own now. His teammates slain by Yuri and there is no way out of this. He'll get every single kill, a quad at the end. And that is a shocking start. Yeah, that's big, way overcomplicating things, making that way too difficult, way too fancy. They got everything. Furia versus MIBR continues onwards and upwards with the CT start from Furia. You can see exit there with the P250. That shot rings out. A couple of smoke grenades here as they want to return back to B late. And look at Ooh. this, Yuri just taking some fights. Cello gone, Woody two, and Yuri's taking down everybody. Oh, well, be so with but Tapson looking to execute over toward the A site instead. Yuri, he knows they're there. Fires in, damage to all of them. Oh Somehow he stays alive and gets away as it was the close player. And Searson that walked into the flyer, walked into the bullets that were already being sprayed toward his teammates. And that's going to give a chance, but Sin's found the corner. He's found the pocket and down goes Art. It's Yuri that wants in next and he is going to have a tough, tough time. But Tapson, 10 HP. Yuri on 43. He's going to spot him. He's going to clutch it. Fury is on the board. A gap in this smoke, Arts. Oh, that's gonna be so painful and so frustrating. A drop position, good find from Yuri as he snuck up over the drywall to get further in before they spotted him. HP is firmly in the favor of the CTs, trying to wrap up and get closer, but Fox has got the shot. Yuri trying to double, he will. He will, and he'll get the defuse as well. Oh, I feel like that should have been impossible. I feel like that should have been a win for Eternal Fire. That, that's, oh, they lose all that battle on the stairs. They had all their players there and Rusty still couldn't blocks. come. That could be good. Oh, all five players tagged by the Nate <laughs> and Yuri. <Okay. laughs> just lines up to a ton through the doorway onto Cirque as well. He just wants to stand in the corner. Yuri, oh, the ace. Easy anti eco. Man, he barely had to see him. Continuing to apply that pressure. Snappy coming at this so that he's busy. And sure enough, it works. Two kills from Snappy. Fresh magazine in. Ready for another. He's got no support here at the moment. No teammate, what? but does he need one? Snappy finding that third kill and pushing all the pressure onto the shoulders of Yuri. He's worried about that flank. It's been so long and still nobody else has showed up. Where the hell are they? Back towards CT and mid, that's where. They're not in a position to rush this bomb down as it gets planted. 40 seconds, Yuri. Will even fake plant? No. He thinks and he knows based on the tendencies of ends that they will give him space here. But they've also been good at coordinating on the retakes. Some pious to the left. Goes down first. Oh. Yuri now headhunting as Valdo works forward. And he's got himself both kills. Oh, was that adjustment? That's Yuri, baby. Unreal. Perfect read on both peaks. And I talked about the coordination between ends. They didn't have it there. 20 seconds as the play is coming in. One kill in the right place at the right time from the right man. Could do it. Yuri drops the bomb. And even though he's gone after that kill, Electronic's doing all he can. There's no winning the round. There's no recovering this 
one. Yuri brings that fury. Extremely light investment. But Yuri could win this round with the gap and the M4 in hand. Has a chance here, and that's a free kill. It's a one-on-one -on -one against Monacy. This could be an absolute disaster for G2, but Monacy is going to be tested early. He has only got a scout in hand. Yuri has the better weapon here. Problem is, Monacy has control of the bomb for the time being. There is so much time. Yuri doesn't need to be in a rush here, and Monacy has no idea where he's gotten off to, so both just hitting the brake. No sound cues coming through, cutting noise. Waiting to see who's going to make the first mistake as part of this. Monacy currently residing in lobby, and Yuri, as he makes his way around ramp, they might have a head-on collision. Well, Monacy knows that he can play with the USP because Yuri doesn't have armor, right? These are all soft opponents, so the USP is good for the tap to the head if Monacy can get it. And Yuri's starting to come back through the ramp. It's all about the timings here as Yuri begins to move his way back into lobby. Monacy holds from Squeaky, dropping back. Yuri spotted him, and it's Furia who tie up the scoreline early. What a massive... Uh, when they came back from the COVID era, you know, the online phase, I feel like everybody in NA was so hyped for that Furia, and it, it kind of fizzled. But now, we've got a beast on our hands. Oof. Yuri going to punish the Pank Peak from the apartments. That one's down early. Just the pistols here floating around. You know, we've got one legend spot here at the America's RMR on the line. I think that we a got lot of the... one legend in the server. Yeah. The conversation, I think, is between Furia and Liquid currently. If I had to gauge the green room at How the moment, you. feels like everybody's sort of leaning that way. Uh, and I'm getting into the domain of G2. If they don't get the bomb down, they can't keep rebuying all the time. So a couple of, you know, easy rounds potentially for Furia to prolong this game. Maybe even close it out to take it to overtime. Double figures, Mark. We're starting to believe again. Yuri removes Jax. They're right in the vision of Furia right now within the arena. They do see that Brazilian corner up there, so the support they are aware is out of force today. G2 right now should be discussing how they want to deny that deep ramp control for Furia because that's too much control being being given away that in turn they have too much information and the rotations are much faster right so you need to either He's in a, yeah. a real power position two fights oh, decide the outcome of the round and with safe dead yuri's got to make a move has got to be the hero 1v3 as it all begins, but they're already on the bomb. Bit Ooh. sticking it, not plotting for Yuri, so he's got to run up, he's got to run oh. in. Wins the first fight. Oh. Oh. Yuri! With three! The hot drink! And another round for Fury at this T side. Lights out to open up. There should have been no question for Na'Vi. They knew exactly where he was. They had him pinned in. Box. Wriggling and writhing in his mouth. Refuses to be chomped. And now this one should just wrap on up. There's nothing really for oh, Yuri here. HP. Yeah, they're so low. He has a kit on drop. And that's the first of the three. Spinks looks like he's going to be an integral component of this because Hades is about to be run down. And it's all onto Spinks. Kits on drop, not on Yuri, and okay, twice now. It felt so good for Ents, and in the last 10 seconds, they managed to rack up a multi. Oh, drop gets diffusers in consecutive rounds here, but the two individuals, and I'll say the names again, Case right on the pistol, and now Yuri in that are the ones Jesus. that pull them out of trouble, right? The it was Yuri. Make sure he cannot feel comfortable whatsoever, but man, the complete wraparound back to lobby, absolutely brutal. A tough way to lose a round, Yuri's up to five kills. I'll tell you what, that pistol round's gonna fire him up as well. Yuri, more kills at hand, sprays them down, another quad kill, and this time he wants the ace. This time he wants to hunt it down, and his teammates are giving him the opportunity. You have to, right? You are on the stage, you're in front of the home crowd. Go get it. Go hunt it down. But I mean, he's going to play this one smart. There's 50 seconds left on the clock. Yeah, pass away the FAMAS. <laughs> oh, Allowing man. his teammate safe's going to bait for him as well. There it is! Oh. All five for Yuri on the big stage, and smiles break out on Furia. Nine kills in two rounds. What a way to get started. But just, just shut down this push. They're committing. They're running right in. No kill for drop. They go over the top and James hides as his teammates provide that cover. It's a smoke spam for Caserato. And as this one fades, he's going to try and finish James off, who again he's just invincible. stares at the floor. This guy digs himself a little hole, puts his head in the sand, and now Yuri's got to somehow dig them out. 1v2. Isolating Norbert, but yeah, nay to James, definitely the play. It's gonna kill him. 1v1, he's got him trapped, and Yuri's gonna win the round. Considering we were talking about this guy coming into the game today, needing to perform, Yuri is putting on a show.
yeah, Shadow really didn't even finish coming around that corner, and I he already had the headshot. I thought the angle was great. But the MP9s also locking it in. Drop, oh my wow. goodness. Kills Lotto, another instant headshot into Barton. <laughs> Finally, somebody puts an end to him, and the bomb falls down with Taco, picked up by Yuri. He's going to challenge, and Taco taken out of this. A 1v2 with now two health left over. He barely got out of the flames within that vent. And as he opens double doors, he welcomes Henny to drop down oh, vent. He's actually going to go back outside. This will be a hard play to read, but... If Yuri doesn't move, or, or sorry, if Henny doesn't move, he's in a good spot. And look at that, he's watching outside. And they both start moving at the exact same moment. But as long as Yuri does continue to go downstairs, he's in a good spot. Yeah, he'll get his plant at least no matter what. Henny only needs to hit one bullet. Technically, so does Yuri. Just got to be right between the eyes. Henny comes down vent. A1S definitely going to make his job a little easier. Yuri gets back through double doors God, into the yeah. vents. Now he has Henny's back. Oh, and Yuri, he takes his knife out. He's wasting no time. Henny, he never sees it coming. Oh, Yuri, that is superb. How does he come up with that? I mean...